you guys see what's on the calendar today? The Iditarod's starting. No, but seriously, Corey's coming home. Way up north in the state of Alaska lives a man, his wife, and kids. And this dude, he lives like hella because that's the way he is. Your daddy's coming home today. Aren't you excited? You're just sleepy. You're just super, super sleepy, aren't you? That's okay, you'll be excited later. Corey doesn't get into town until pretty late tonight, I think around 10.30, so we have a lot of day to have without him still, but I'm so excited for him to be home. We are gonna be going into Anchorage. The Iditarod race is starting. If you guys don't know what the Iditarod is, it's a huge, massive dog sled race. Um, it's been going on in Alaska for a very, very long time. I'll tell you a little bit more about it when we get to downtown, but it's really, really cool. We also have to clean house. Like, it is getting crazy in here. We were working on filming some videos that I needed to get done yesterday, and then it was so funny, like the other day we realized Corey was coming home early, which is awesome, but we were like, wait, all those projects we wanted to get done before he got home, we have to get them done now. So we like started emptying out the garage and doing all sorts of work. So the house is kind of a wreck right now, but it's progress. I feel like in order to get your house in order, like in order to give stuff away or sell stuff or anything, you have to get a little messy first. So it's okay, it's okay. It will get done before he gets home, hopefully. It's so funny, Chell started getting sleepy and we weren't quite ready to go yet, but we wanted to sleep in the car because why not? And so we're all just like running around like, quick, get ready, finish. <laughs> But I think we're gonna make it. Mom is doing good keeping her awake while she's finishing up, so I think this is gonna work out. Don't go to sleep yet. It's a big Don't yawn. <laughs> you can start falling asleep. <laughs> so of course, like Chell's ready to go. We think we're ready to walk out the door. Wait, where's her bottle? We can't find her bottle. Now we're frantically looking for that. And then mom goes, I don't know where my cell phone is. Why does it always happen that when you're like ready to leave and you're in a hurry, you can't find anything? Where's your bottle? Where is it? I know, you're ready to go, huh? You're ready for the car to rock you to sleep. Refrigerator. It's in the refrigerator. Smart. Good spot. Mom's phone, not in the refrigerator. Where's your phone? Oh, right there at the charger. Oh, good spot. <laughs> good spot, Chill. Where it should be. <laughs> Where's Chill? Oh, no. Oh, no. Chill. There she is. We never lose you. No. So we made it downtown to see the start of the I Did Rod. There are tons of people here and tons of dogs. It's gonna be a fun event. There's so many people here excited to see the Edge of Red start, but none of them are as excited as these dogs. They are ready to go. Ali Zirkel went to the starting line and she's pretty high celebrity status when it comes to mushers. So everybody cheered really loud and Chill didn't like it. Too noisy, huh? She doesn't like when people get that happy, you know? But, so we found a nice little warm spot inside, taking a little break. So they have their dog team and it's interesting because you can see the lady sitting on the dog sled. She actually probably paid a quite a bit of money to do that. She's like an honorary rider. So today she gets to ride the whole race course with them. We stopped in at this little bakery to get warm and look at that. Remember our friend James from Daybreak? He's the co-host. Look at his photography. Like these bears are just awesome. If you guys want to look at his photography close up, it is jamesgaddisphoto.com. You can check it out. He has all these awesome I did rod prints that apparently come in postcard size and big metal prints. Size. It's nice because even if you come to the Edge of Rod, like not everyone can get photos like that. So it's cool to have the option to buy them. And this is artwork in its own right. Look how beautiful their pastries are. It's the Alaska Cake Studio, if you guys are ever in downtown. Mom's finding all sorts of stuff to get and Chell's just making all sorts of friends. Miss Chell, what are you doing down there? Are you playing in the pasta? 
We're filming some more videos for Millennial Moms and this one is all about developmental play for eight months old. Let's just say this game's a little messy, but it's not like it's not easy to clean up. It's just pasta, it's not cooked or anything. And she seems to be loving it. I just got to the airport to pick up Corey and I'm in such a hurry, like his plane already landed, but look quickly. I have my, no, turn on, turn on. Okay, I have my sign for him. I have a banana and some almonds and some peanut m and and I have to go, I have to go. Ooh, I am so excited for him to be home. I know he was sitting in 26A because yes, I'm, I looked like I, I know. Um, so he's at the back of the plane, so maybe he's not here yet, we're hoping not. Okay, I don't see him, we made it. I'm like shaking a little bit, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, there he is. <laughs> Okay, I'm too excited. <laughs> hey, you with the hair. Okay, babe, how does nine degrees feel? It's very cold. I don't have any more body fat. <laughs> my body fat is freaking gone, dude. Oh my god. But it's Alaska. It feels great. Oh, yeah. I can feel my nipples again. <laughs> Like for real, dude, they're just getting sharper and sharper. I'm gonna start cutting some glass in this place. Oh my god. You know you love it. I do love it. I love you. Yeah, I, love I, lo it. I love Alaska. Right here, get in the car. Okay, okay. Hey, do you want to drive? <laughs> oh, you're home. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm eating processed foods again. No, you drive. I'm too tired. <laughs> okay, my handsome husband. Mm. Since you're home, you get to say goodbye. Oh, that's right. The whole goodbye. It's been a long time since I, I said know. goodbye. I've been doing this thing because that's the S&P Films thing. Yeah. I know people ask, how can we do this? What's this weird salute? I don't know what that is. That's just what I've been doing for <laughs> ever. So. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed today's vlog. Make sure you watch for tomorrow because tomorrow... I get to see my baby girl. She's sleeping right now. It's super late. And dude, I need to sleep. You're so tired. I'm so tired. I've been traveling <laughs> for like 24 hours. So yeah, hope you guys had an awesome day. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Saying goodbye to sunshine. Saying goodbye to warm. Heading to Alaska where ice will be the norm. So much to see. So much to do. And the best part is we're sharing it with